So I have a Raspberry Pi here, Raspberry Pi 4 with 4 gigabytes of memory. What I'm going to do is I'm going to connect the camera to the Raspberry Pi. I'm first going to put the camera into the box. For that, I need to take the lens off. Yeah, so once I take the lens off, basically what I need to do is... So the lens itself is going to secure the camera to the box, which is nice. It's all good, yeah? Now, it's time to connect the camera. Blue ribbon facing the back. It won't damage the camera anyway, if you get it wrong. Okay, so now, everything in place. And I have my Raspberry Pi camera ready to go. Looks quite nice, isn't it? First thing I need to do is to run sudo apt update. So, and now I need to enable the camera via the Raspi config utility. My user has root access, so I'm doing sudo raspconf. So I go to interfacing options and I select P1 camera and then it will ask me to if I want to enable the camera and I say yes. And at this stage, I should reboot. If Minus V for verbals, it gives me more output and if something goes wrong, I will be able to get a proper error message. Minus O is output and then I give it a file name. Yeah, so it kind of took a picture, but it didn't show me any uh, a preview. So I've changed the name of the picture, so I don't overwrite the previous picture I took. And I'm taking another picture with low light just to see the difference. You see the difference? This one looks a little bit pink, doesn't it? It's to do with the camera itself. So FFmpeg is like the Swiss knife of video. So this is creating a five seconds video. Um, the Raspberry Pi actually outputs everything in, in uh, H.264 format. Five seconds from the camera. So if I want to pass in uh, the number of seconds I want to record, I can pass in 10,000, which is uh, one second is a thousand milliseconds. So this is 10 seconds. So I'm going to go and just wave at the camera. So I'm going to record a 30 seconds video. It doesn't seem to be a very high frame rate. So it's not doing justice to the camera, by the way. Okay, let me just go. I can capture a video from the Raspberry Pi camera. I would love to get the streaming to work. So I have a live stream. This is from my Raspberry Pi. So I'm going to go in front of the camera. I'll wave my hands. I'll switch on the lights as well, just to make it a little bit brighter. 
we set a low frame rate on purpose and uh, yeah this is good <laughs> 